this is the book haul of The Logic of Jan Doesn't Make Sense. So... Jay and today I am here with a books a million book haul. We don't have books a million in Canada and my mom and I took a little road trip to Erie, Pennsylvania and I discovered the magical place that is books a million and there's bargain books that are like three dollars and your girl was so excited. I honestly could have gone insane in that store but I tried to have some self-control and only picked up four books so I figured I would show them to you guys today. So without further ado, let us get started. So the first book that I picked up is Stealing Snow and this is by Danielle Page and it's I believe a retelling of Snow White. Honestly, I haven't really heard if it's good or bad or not. So if you guys have read this, let me know down below if you enjoyed it or not. But I'm just, a, you know, a sucker for fairy tale retellings and just buy them all. So here we are. The next book I have is another one that my logic behind my purchase doesn't make a lot of sense, but we did it anyways and here we are. It's Tower of Dawn by Sarah J. Mass. This is the sixth book in the Thorn of Glass thing going on. I have not even read Throne of Glass, so why I bought this book, I don't know. It was only $4. In my head, I was like, now I have the whole thing, so I can read the whole thing and not have to wait to buy the next book. Again, my logic does not always make sense, but now I have the full series, so there's that. The next book that I have, I actually was very excited about, and it is The Darkest Corners by Kara Thomas, and this is a psychological thriller about two girls who I believe committed a crime and then after the trial one of them leaves town but then she returns years later and I think the trial is like catching up to her. Honestly I'm not even that sure. I heard about this book a long time ago when it first came out and I recognized the cover and I was like it's only five dollars so let's buy it. And then the final book that I picked up honestly was only because it looked creepy and I was like I love me some creepy things so it is Diary of a Haunting by M. Verano and it's about this girl named Paige who moves to LA into this old abandoned house and then her brother starts hearing things and very creepy things begin happening and it's kind of like her keeping track of all of that and you know I just I'm weird and like creepy things so I saw it and I was like I need that in my life so again the logic of Jan doesn't make a lot of sense but it was only three dollars so I bought it all right guys so that was my books a million book haul let me know down below if you guys have read any of these what you thought of them and I will see you all in my next video goodbye